to you guys about cosmetics. Um, to begin with, um, who here wears cosmetics? Is that makeup? <laughs> <laughs> uh, why aren't the guys raising their hands? According to Baha Munzar, a professor at SRTM University, he wrote an article titled Cosmetic Consumption of Females defines cosmetics as any substance used to clean, improve, or change the com complexion of skin, hair, nails, or teeth. Okay? Uh, cosmetics include beauty preparations and grooming aids. This includes makeup, perfume, <coughs> cream, deodorant, shampoo, shaving cream, and aftershave. <laughs> 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 okay, so these are examples of what cosmetics basically is. Like I asked you guys, majority of the girls raised their hands. So I'll ask another poll. Who here wears cosmetics or uses cosmetics? Okay, so everybody should be um, I hopefully at least everybody wears or cleans themselves. Oh. <laughs> I don't. Hey. Hey. <laughs> okay. uh, okay. Um, well, I've done extensive research on cosmetics, specifically more towards your Turk female. I've done research before, so I know um, the effects of it. I have also. Um, done in the past research and I've done tests to know about these things and I'll talk to you about this a little bit later. Um, so to begin with I'm going to talk to you about uh, females and two specifically two types of cosmetics within females and two for the male that they mostly use. Um, and lastly I'll speak about like um, what is it called alternatives so that you can start changing the way you use your cosmetics. Okay. So to begin with, um, lipstick. So women, according to Sandra Yours, a, a journalist for the Philadelphia Inquirer and author of The Concern of Pearl Personal Care Products, she mentioned that the average woman uses 12 personal care products a day. This is the average woman, okay? Only 12. Um, I'm, I personally don't really wear that much um, like face makeup, but the girls who do, okay, you have to keep in count um, primer. They have to wash their face, primer, uh, eyeshadow, eyeshadow concealer, and like all this other stuff um, that you put on your face, and you don't really know what's going on to your face. Um, <laughs> so to begin with, first, I'll be speaking about um, lipstick. A research conducted at UC Berkeley with Lao Tse and others found that women have high intake of metals due to lipstick. So their research showed that the lipsticks contain magnesium, titanium, aluminum, and with the highest concentrations of titanium and aluminum. Um, so basically, whatever you put your lips, you're kind of basically eating, right? Like it, or it like evaporates 